Um, Prime Cabinet Secretary, uh, Mr. Chancellor, sir, uh, CSS, PSS, uh, ladies and gentlemen, good evening. I'm not too sure I saw any other judge, but if there's a judge here, please uh, stand up. As I suspected, there's none, except myself. <laughs> Greetings from the Chief Justice who sent me here to represent her. I'm very happy she chose me. I doubt anyone would have wanted to miss that speech. Number one. Number two, I have the position of lead judge in technology adoption in the judiciary. So all these things that we do, I'm waking up at three in the morning because the system down, uh, uh, downside. So the conversation around AI has hit my heart. Like when you were young and trying to get saved in church because some preachers come and has hit your heart. Let me make a commitment therefore that on the AI uh, conversation, please involve the judiciary. We are Africa's leader now with regard to uptake of technology. And we have delegations from across Africa coming to see what we are doing around technology. Working with the University of Nairobi, I am certain we shall get to go to much, much higher levels. Number two, the question of leadership and the center. Again, involve us in this. We in the judiciary are assumed to be characters who sit somewhere up there, issue judgment, sentence people to death, <laughs> as if we are not leaders. We are leaders because we are a whole arm of government. If we don't get training into leadership in the judiciary, we shall have a whole arm left out there led by people who themselves don't know where they are going. So if we can have a role and a part in the leadership center, I'm sure the judiciary of Kenya will continue leading even that area. And very lastly, as G34 stroke 5334 stroke 87, who entered the University of Nairobi on the 15th of July, 1987, and left on the 29th of October, 1990, I can speak with authority and say, we should be the leaders at every sector because we are the University of Nairobi. <laughs> this, this afternoon, we hosted all the universities uh, of, of, in Kenya, their deans and lecturers and students. And we committed to partner with them, and, and the dean of the University of Nairobi is here, on moot courts, mentorship, and we as judges of the Supreme Court committed to have a lecture circuit starting this September across the country at every law school for the foreseeable future to encourage, mentor our young budding lawyers to one day aspire to be like Martha Kome or indeed myself. Good evening. 